I didn't really know what to expect coming in here after the holidays. Um, first meet long course, so tried to get in and not really think too much, just see what I could do. I tried to not slow my stroke rate down coming into the wall, which I, I did this morning, so I worked a bit on that tonight. But um, yeah, honestly, I was just thinking about holding, trying to hold strong water while keeping a high stroke rate but not spinning. So trying to find that balance. I will be in January. I, I've had some issues um, getting a visa and just had some obligations. And I committed to doing the World Cup circuit and I wanted to do short course worlds in the fall. So the fall was super busy and I didn't spend a lot of time in Spain. But I, I will be going there after this meet. We go to a training camp and then I'll fly from there to Spain and then I'll be there for the foreseeable future. <laughs> yeah, it was tough. Um, to be honest, I hadn't, I haven't spent the more than two weeks in the same place since like August, beginning of September. So it's, I knew that was going to be the case, and I knew it was going to be busy. But I don't think it made it any easier come December and and come, you know, the end of that short course season. So it was challenging, but I'm I'm glad I did it. I'm glad it's behind me, and I'm pleased that I got some incredible experiences and just I think I, I learned a lot about myself through that period of time and I think it'll bode well for the future for me. Just patience and I think learning to enjoy the process a bit more. I knew I wasn't in the best shape. I knew I didn't have consistent training blocks because of traveling a lot and just figuring out my life and logistics. So I knew that was the case, but I still put the pressure on myself to be at the best, and to be my best, and to want to be at the top. So I think finding the, the in-between, between allowing myself to keep things in perspective, but also wanting to perform was a struggle. So learning that whole process about myself was what I learned this fall. that I really rely and I enjoy routine and structure and that wasn't always the case when I was traveling and going kind of bouncing around so I think just finding little things within my daily life that gave me that sense of routine and just kind of gave me that stability um, whether that was in practice something small that I wanted to work on or you know keeping in touch with family and friends at home or just keeping things light to um, yeah help myself enjoy the process and kind of see the light at the end of the tunnel throughout all of the craziness.